Hi everyone, today I'm just going to show you how to import your mailing list and your contacts. The first thing that you need to do is you need to create a new mailing list and give it a name. For this one I'm going to call it Travel People. Then yes, I do want it to display on my subscription form. So I'm going to select this here, then click Save. Now as you can see, my new mailing list appears over here in this first menu here. And now what I want to do is just to import my Excel spreadsheet of contact information and email addresses and just match it up to the mailing list that I've just created, which is this one here, Travel People. So what I do is I just click on this import section here and a pop-up will appear. Now you can choose to add your contact information and your email addresses by either copying and pasting or importing from online email accounts. But for the sake of this video, I'm just going to upload the Excel spreadsheet I showed you earlier. So I'll just browse for my file over here. Then I simply select the mailing list that I've just created. You can obviously use an existing mailing list. And then the mobile list, if you're interested in sending out SMS sends, so I've just clicked the default phone book and I'll just click continue. And we just wait a bit for that to upload. And once uploaded, we just check that everything is mapped correctly. That just basically means that your headings match the details within the column and within your spreadsheet. So over here, you can see that everything is correct. Now, your account comes with a default address book or an address book with predefined fields. And these over here are all of your predefined fields. So everything looks in order for this. So we just press continue. And then you can see it all here within the grid, and then just finish. And then once complete, we close the window, and we give it about three seconds for the system to update everything. And there you go. As you can see in my travel people mailing list, I've got all of the contacts over here. If I select my contact, I can view all of their details here. I can select this here to edit. And if I want to add a single contact to this mailing list, I then just click over here to add a new one. And then I'd fill in all the necessary fields. And that is how you upload your imports, your mailing lists, and your contact details.